Hey everyone, welcome back for some more GTA 5 and uh, as you can see, Michael's acting crazy, all crazy and stuff after um, his family left him. But anyways, today is a good day in GTA 5 and we are off to... No, oh, it's a rainy day, my bad. So, we are off to do some another, do another mission and we need to meet with David and his friends. Um, those are some other official jerks. Um, which work with David. I don't know them yet. Oh, I forgot that we'll, we had also parked this here. And uh, I want to take this instead of that crappy old car. So, with this our exotic car, this being our exotic car, let's head to our location. And um, this is going to be another one of the being one of David's lackeys as his problems are technically our problems as well so we have to help him help him out with the stuff he says us to do or gives us the work he gives us which is not um, not that bad not that bad since it also benefits us in many ways and uh, one more thing I wanted to tell you guys that uh, approximately 97% of you guys not subscribe to the channel at all so please subscribe to the channel as it ha as it's it's a sad view from my perspective and uh, not good for the channel as mm, everybody who's watching the video is not subscribed. So please subscribe to the channel and um, yeah do watch the video till the end till the end as it might be spicy maybe maybe who knows. And one more thing, I also recorded Warframe's Sacrifice Quest, but um, to my... Yeah, oh damn it. But uh, I had a real bad luck and uh, the whole thing got recorded, but, but the voice, the audio, yeah, it didn't got recorded at all. So now I have to do that again, all over, all over again. And um, yeah, it's quite a pain in the ass. But it's um, it's not that bad. Um, along with that, um, I will also upload uh, Genshin Impact tomorrow as well. Um, since um, the files which I recorded for today, um, the Warframe files for the sacrifice are not not up to the mark. So yeah, okay. So let's get this and uh, yeah we are at the place and uh, the cutscene is about to start now. So yeah I'll catch you in the next one and uh, enjoy. Michael. See ya. David. Well isn't this nice? You didn't tell me we were double dating. Sorry guys. This bar and hunk of love is all mine. <laughs> Brilliant. Steve Haynes amigo but you probably knew that already. Sorry your name tag must have fallen off. Oh <laughs> duh. I love it. I, I gotta remember to write that down. And to shoot you in your head, you annoying dick. <laughs> Andres, taking notes? This stuff? Whoa! Pure magic. They should put it on my show. Have you seen my show? You mean how to dress like a salesman on a cheap golf weekend at a third rate country club? <laughs> so. Well done with our, uh, our friend, Mr. K. My pleasure. Uh, I love helping our government wage war, especially with itself. But you made a mistake. Did I, Cupcake? Why don't you keep your fucking voice down before I close your fucking windpipe? The joke stopped now, pal. You will show me and my team some respect. Maybe you could define team for me. Is that just the three of you? Or the greater FIB? Or the entire government? Because I'm tempted to argue that thus far, we haven't shown a lot of your colleagues a whole lot of respect. Then why don't you start with me, genius? You got it, pal. We have received intel that they're keeping Mr. K at the local agency station. I just dealt with that guy. The agency is stepping up their questioning because of your moronic antics down at the coroner's office. We need to get him out of there before he blabs. I did what Agent Norton said. Then I guess you getting involved with a clapped out old agent who's been living off of past glories was your first mistake. 
You are my boy now, amigo. Oh. My career depends on this, and that's very important to me. So seeing as we're all boys now, that makes it important to you. Now run along, kids. See, there you go, Dave. You can teach an old dog new tricks. Let's go. The Bureau owns a lot out in East L.S. Covington Supplies off El Rancho. Can you take us there? Yeah, sure. Sounds nice and secluded. Kind of place you'd run an off-the-books operation, huh? So what? So I bet Federal ain't on the deed, that's so. And we all like our Federal government open and transparent. Except when closed and opaque suits you better. I'm just a puppet. You're the one pulling the strings. Tell me, Davey, you expense this ride to the taxpayer? I need you to make a couple of calls. Get some people on board. Shit. First guy is Franklin Clinton. Hey, I... I barely know that kid. He's fixing up my car. Call him or we'll send some G-men to his aunt's house. Okay. Okay. Michael, this ain't the best time. I'm kind of busy. Hey, sorry about that. Listen, you know that thing we talked about before? It's happening. I need you to come to a lot off El Rancho, not far from where we met before. All right, that's cool. I'm in LS anyway. Now, Trevor Phillips. Oh, you're crazy. I ain't... Look out! You're crazy. I ain't calling him. I thought you might say that. So we had him picked up. That's a dumb move. Stop! That's a dumb move, Dave. Real fucking dumb. Just worry about the plan, okay? Getting Mr. K out of the IAA station. Clinton is going to be positioned across the street, keeping an eye on the proceedings. Phillips flies you in, you rappel down, make the extraction. And I'm the best guy you got for this. With you, we've got good leverage. Great! And you brought Trevor in. We're telling him I'm all... Hey! We're telling him I'm all cozy with the F5B. You'll need discreet support. We'll maintain control of the situation. Discreet? Control? Yeah, good luck controlling discreet... No more car accidents. Good luck controlling discreet Trevor. Now, I wonder how controllable and discreet he'll be when he sees the guy who killed me and put Brad in jail. Maybe I'll hang back. Yeah, that might be a good idea. False. Oh, Damn degenerate! You know what? You better keep a low profile. Yeah, I think I will. See you later. Who's that cagey motherfucker, huh? No, it's another cagey motherfucker, all right? Not you! Hey, T, enough with the faux political bullshit! <sighs> Franklin, come on, you better take off. Really. Shit, I'm good. I ain't Bill. Whoa. What, am I detecting some, uh, some sort of, uh, son I never had bullshit here, Mikey, huh? Hey, listen. If you want to replace some father figure, you can do a lot better than this fat snake, all right? This fucker would eat his own kids. Like I said, Franklin, deranged. Yeah, and best friend. <laughs> exactly. That's Trevor, my best friend. That's Franklin, the son I always wanted. <sighs> all right, guys, listen, this is the shot. I'm gonna do all the heavy lifting on this job, okay? Trevor, all I need you to do is fly me to the target. Franklin, you're gonna cover me from across the street. We're gonna make these assholes happy, and we're gonna walk away from this thing clean. Got it? I got you. All right. And we do this, and they help us spring Brad, right? Yeah. We'll talk about Brad later, all right? I gotta change. You better grab a head start. Nice to meet you, homie. Yeah, whatever.
The government gimp at last. Eh, yeah, bite me. Let's go. All right, let's do this thing. We need to go to the agency headquarters downtown. Your new friends are a riot. No wonder you said sayonara to the old crew. Walking away ain't easy, Trev. But sometimes I guess you gotta make compromises. What happened to dying with a gun in your hand? Life happened. Annoying wife, two kids. Remember them? You get tied down, you can't move anymore. What about your ties to me? To Brad? Those ties are why you got roped in on this FIB instigated suicide pact. For as long as it keeps me amused, I am. I ain't exactly sure it's gonna be amusing. We'll see. You know, you had me at suicide pact. I'm going in on the west side of the tower. Get us in position, I'll drop. Next, I'll have this thing so far up your ass, your tonsils will be playing shadow puppets. You think we can't do that? We can. It's in our guidelines. I don't know what you're talking about. I install cinema equipment, not surveillance. Grab his other arm. No, 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 no. Oh, 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 oh. Ah! Ah! You think you're impenetrable? See how you feel when this is 18 inches deep inside? No. Get the lube. Actually, no, no. fuck the lube. Let's dry dock him. Who the fuck is this? Terminate him. Close this problem right now. Yeah, I can use a little backup here. Get me the station, Chief! I'm not... 36 flow. I got you. We are not here to fire on Mr. K. We are taking fire from... Hey! Oh, no. don't, don't shoot me! Is someone gonna neutralize this situation? Hey, you're so out of here! No, 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 no! Where's the second shooter? Shit, fuck shit! What the hell is going on? We got a window, T! Pull us out! They're extracting the asset! Oh. We need the asset intact! T, we need to be clear of this building! There's guys shooting at you, Mikey! That's unfinished business! Clean it up! We'll move on! You damn softy! I knew you were a liability, you fucking card! <laughs> Don't get angry, Michael! Do something! I'm slipping! That's it! Get us out of here! Roger that! Whoa! Looks like we've attracted the attention of their air unit. You got a bogey coming at you, Franklin! I thought I had the easy job. An attack on U.S. government agents is an act of war. We are clear to engage you. That ain't far work is at me, man. What the fuck is this? Fuck you, too! I ain't gonna miss his ass. Hey, I'm clean over here. Good work! I don't want to disturb you, Mike. But you... Might want to do something about the coppers before we're blown out of the sky. Just oh, oh, shit! Shit! I've been found! Just strapped in, you'll be fine! Plan immediately or your aircraft will be forcibly grounded. 
said they were a government. I do home theater. I'm not a... I don't care who you are. Then why are you doing this to me? <laughs> hey, hold tight. I got some friends with the Bureau. They'll explain everything. You saved me. Thank you. Thank you. Don't mention it. The Bureau. The FIB. They will make everything okay? I'm sure. Don't worry. They'll look after you. The things those people did to me. I'm an American citizen. Yeah, well, that don't seem to matter too much. Put her down in the lot, Trevor. It easy. Oh, oh, come on, give the guy a break. Oh. I'm gonna get out of this shit. Ha <laughs> ha! In bed with the bureau and a new running buddy. Yeah, he's more of a protege. Yeah, what? You gonna teach him to be old before his time? Yeah, to never grow up. That seems like a good kid. Michael, huh, look at this, huh? New city, new set of problems, but the idiots, uh, they stay the same. Yep, I guess. All right, Trevor, I'll see you later. Oh, you better believe it, buddy. 